there's something so special about you and me, babe You got me, you got me, you got me feeling fine So just say the words cause you know what it means to me, babe Hey guys, it's Tisha Sade and I'm back with another video So quick FYI guys this video will cut off abruptly at the end because my camera cut off on me. Okay, so with that being said, welcome back to my channel, guys. Yes, this video is going to be about how I achieved this slick back bun using my own hair. Okay, because sometimes we need to um, just give the other hair a break. All right, and I'm a huge fan of that. So with that being said, guys, I achieved this slick back bun with a method that I've used for years. And it is getting in the shower and forming my ponytail instead of building up ponytails. To me, that is time consuming and honestly, it's time consuming. And then getting out and using oil. So I see a lot of YouTube videos floating around with girls with hair like me. And what I don't see is that they utilize water and oil. So, with that being said, guys, you need both in order to, if you have thick hair like me, because yes, my hair is thick. If you have thick hair like me, kinky hair, whatever the case may be, oil and water is your best friend because it helps with the ponytail. It helps form the ponytail. It helps with dryness, breakage, amongst other things. So, yeah, a lot of the times I see in these videos that they are showing people how to achieve a slick back bun but they're not using the essentials, oil and water. You're using gel and no matter what your gel label says, you still need water, sis, because you want to prevent the flakiness. You want to prevent the dryness from drying out, yeah. So when I go in and I wash this out, my hair is still moisturized after, as opposed to it being dry, flaky, or when the gel dries up after a couple days, I don't get a lot of white residue. So yeah, if you're interested in how I achieve this using my method, then continue watching guys. the shower and now I'm about to complete the ponytail so what I'm going to use is eco styler I have a little bit of oil um I will refill this later of course I have the brush in Z comb I have the other knotless band and I have my edge brush toothbrush so yeah guys it kind of dried because I did the rest of my showerly duties while I was in the shower. So, but the ponytail is still dripping wet. So I have the towel here, but I like to do my ponytail wet because to me, 
that makes it effortless it makes the time go by shorter what I like to do is I like to do the band swap so now that I've pretty much perfected most of the ponytail I can go back in and re tighten it because I've brushed down enough hair to do this so I go on with the new band Yo, my camera cut off. So yeah, you go ahead and tie it up. And this is what I call kinky hair baking. All it is, guys, is hopping in the shower, forming your ponytail, getting out of the shower, using your gel or whatever you do to slick back your hair, 
and the key is using water oh yeah and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next video guys